How does a computer work? Hi there friends. The different parts of a computer have separate functions but they all work together to complete a task. A computer system consists of the many parts that make up the computer. These parts are divided into input devices like keyboard and mouse, output devices like monitor and printer and the CPU where all the memory is present and all the data is processed. How do the parts of a computer system come together to work? To do any work on the computer, we have to follow these three simple steps. Step 1. Input Step 2. Process Step 3. Output This is called IPO or Input Process Output Cycle. We can use simple examples from our daily life to understand the IPO cycle. For making orange juice, the input needed for making orange juice is oranges and juicer. The process involves the juicer taking out the juice of the oranges. What we get as output is the orange juice. Here is another example. For turning on the TV, the input required is the remote control for the TV and the TV itself. The process is pressing of the remote and reception of the remote signal by the TV. We get to watch our favorite channel as the output. We can also understand input process output through our body parts. Our body takes input from nose, eyes, ears and hands. So, if we are walking and there's a hole in the ground, the eyes will see it and send the input to the brain. After that, our brain processes and calculates the collected data. It will realize that we can fall and hurt ourselves and it is best to avoid it. So the brain sends the output message to the legs and we safely jump over the hole. We see the IPO cycle in many more instances. For sharpening a pencil, the input needed is a sharpener and a blunt pencil. The process involves turning the pencil in the sharpener. The output is a sharp pencil. If we want to prepare mixed fruit juice, the input will be different kinds of fruit and the juicer. The process will be the juicer extracting the juice. We get a glass of mixed fruit juice as the output. To make a phone call, we need a phone and the number to be called. The process involves dialing of the number and connecting the call. The output is the phone conversation. What is input process output for a computer? Input is a way of communication with computer. We enter data and instructions into the computer as input. We can enter input through input devices. Input devices are keyboard, mouse, scanner, microphone, etc. Processing means working on the data according to the given instructions. Data and instructions are provided as inputs. CPU processes the data. The output is information or final result. We can see output and output devices. Output devices are monitor, printer, speaker, etc. When we provide input to the computer, there have to be two parts to the input. One is the data, 
like in the example the data is the numbers 4 and 2 the other part is the instruction that is we have to tell the computer what to do with the data here the instruction is multiply in the processing phase CPU will multiply 4 by 2 8 is the result or final output in this example Three numbers are given as data and the instruction is to arrange them in ascending order. In the processing, CPU will arrange the numbers in ascending order as per the instruction. 3, 4, 15 is the final output which is in ascending order.